All right, we have uh, Mr. Jimmy D from Nampu Productions, Jimmy D Productions, uh, online with us. And uh, he's here to talk to me about uh, his latest discovery. Uh, her name is Haani. And uh, hey, Mr. Jimmy D, how you doing? Hey, Ryan, doing very well today, man. Thanks a lot. All right, so hey, you know, uh, tell us all about this new discovery of yours. Well, I'll tell you what, man, it's uh, actually it's been a while because uh, earlier this, uh, you know, lovely young lady, uh, she was barely, I think, 16, 17, came to me and asked me to, to help her, you know, and uh, promote her and uh, record her and all that kind of stuff. And I looked at her, she was a bit too young at the time. But I said, well, I'll tell you what, why don't you just come on in, let's take some information on you and uh, let's, re you know, talk a bit. So we did it. And, uh, you know, she sang. I said, oh, that's just pretty good for her age, you know, and, and not quite familiar with the uh, the scene over there yet. And uh, so I said, okay, let's give it a shot. So, you know, we left it at that after we exchanged information and, and updates. Then, uh, of course, a uh, couple, let's say about a month or two later, she called me and says, Sir Jim, uh, is it possible for you to uh, please uh, uh, come and uh, listen to my uh, performance uh, on, a, on a contest? And it just so happens that it was close to, to my condo office. Uh, so I said, okay. I got some guys and uh, we went down to listen and have a drink while we listened to her uh, for the contest. I was just floored because she's absolutely amazing. I mean, she was just spectacular on stage. Uh, nowhere do you see a young little girl, uh, so to speak, uh, you know, performing, but a seasoned performer. You know, she's really polished, really good. She mm -hmm. moves. She has a personality, stage presence and all that. So I said, okay. Let's let's do something about this young lady, and that's how we started. And then we recorded her. I asked Dot the Attorney Dot to uh, really, uh, you know, see if we could put some songs together for her. Then I asked Dot the Diego to use a Bell House Studios in Makati, and I says, let's do something, guys. Let's let's. I think this lady has great potential and uh, a star uh, in the making. So let's uh, let's do something about it, and we did. All right. And, so that's how we started, man. And uh, now the rest is going to be history, I think, because uh, I think she's got a couple of uh, good songs uh, that are be really for us, uh, all of us. I like to think uh, uh, hit records. You know? Yeah, yeah. You know, I that's uh, where we are. I had a chance uh, through you to listen to some of her, some of uh, some of her uh, her music and everything. Now. You know, I mean, I, I liken her to, you know, people like uh, Leah Salonga. She she has a voice like Leah Salonga, but then she can also do some stuff like the Miley Cyrus and the Adriana Evans and, you know, all the, the, the U.S. Uh, artists and everything. But, uh, I mean, and, and I mean, she, it seems like she, she can do a lot of uh, different genres of music in terms of if uh, she wanted to go more popish U.S. style, she can do that. If she wants to go to a more con uh, adult contemporary, she could do that as well. And, uh, you know, I mean, and, and I guess for the listening audience out there that are listening to us right now, uh, how old is she now? She's, uh, I believe, 19 years old. Uh -huh. <laughs> you know, I think I met her when she was 16 or 17, like that. And uh, now, I think two years later, she's uh, even more seasoned and more polished. And, uh, you know, we're looking forward to a, a major concert show out here in Guam mm -hmm. and the Philippines and Hawaii. And hopefully, I uh, would take it all the way to the States. That's she's right. got that great potential. Man. I mean, you know, judging by, by what I'm hearing, I'm telling you, uh, I, I think uh, you guys are on the right track. Now, um, currently she's in the studio. Uh, she currently has uh, about six songs out right now, and she's working on like, what, four or five more? Yes, that's right. We're getting Dante uh, treated on and uh, some of the best over there, uh, you know, where she's at, to put together an album, and it should be released. And the songs are available, by the way, on uh, TuneCore, you know, and stuff like that, iTunes and all that. Yeah. And it's, uh, as we talk, everything is being set up for anyone to purchase the songs, you know. What we did was put snippets, or what we call just a bit of the songs. Yeah, of, little uh, samples. What she did on. Uh, mm -hmm. on Facebook and Twitter etc but so they can listen to her but you know like I say I think we got a 
great potential, this uh, young lady. Yeah, but, uh, you know, I mean, uh, any future dates on uh, her coming on to the island? Well, I'll tell you what, uh, we're hoping for a big hit record out here, and uh, she's going to be ready for probably even a few hours, you know. Uh, so at some of the hotels, naturally, you want to do whatever we can. Uh, you know, I think about the showbiz, man, it's, uh, it's a tough world, you know, uh, and... Uh, Anything can happen, but uh, we're prepared to back her up, support her, and and hopefully that through your, uh, you know, uh, playing her songs and uh, helping us too and getting it airplayed. Uh, we really hope, Brian, that, uh, you know, this is going to really, really happen. And uh, so we look forward to it, and we thank you for your part, man. Oh, hey, thank you, man, and, and thank you for helping out all those uh, struggling artists out there, man. I mean, again, uh, you do great work uh, from what you do as far as the promotions and uh you know the the producing side so uh kudos to you and company and uh hey let's get the show on the road man hey listen i, I just want to add for our, our guam audiences you know uh, our fellow guam and my uh, fellow chamorros right here in guam that you know uh, i've always been looking for talents you know and if you got it uh, if you got if you've got a talent out there you're viable you're marketable but you really got it i mean hey don't hesitate. Give me a call. Come to me. Let me see how I can, what I can do to help anybody up there. You know. So that's it. You know. I've been doing this for years, and I, I've got produced uh, so many talents out here in Guam. Honestly, mm -hmm. and it's just that you know some of these people they have other things they are more focused on, whereas some of the people uh, uh, you know in other countries they're focused on their career, or their recordings, their their shows, their concerts. You know. So at least for a lot of years they put a lot of work into it just like you know some of our, our other people that are very very successful yes 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 and how can they get a hold of you uh do you have an email address yes i have an email address and uh, <laughs> let me give it to you if they want to write me it's a super rich star one at yahoo.com all right or they can reach me facebook uh, as a superstar gvd or just james d Got it. All right, Mr. Jimmy. Uh, we'll talk later, man. But thank you for uh, for getting on with us uh, on the air. Yeah, thank you, man. And I appreciate uh, your call to uh, Ryan. Uh, thank you very much, man. I look forward to chatting with you more. And, uh, hey, listen, you make time. Let's get together for a couple of drinks at uh, Jimmy D's Beach uh, Bar Resort. Yes, okay? yes, we'll, we'll do that. All right. And, uh, you know, uh, her name is Haani. And she's 19 years old, and she is the latest production of uh, Jimmy D. Uh, hey, we look forward to hearing her more, man. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. Have a good day, man. Appreciate it.